Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So here I am showing how to create uh, dynamic block for cable tray or uh, dynamic blocks how we can create it. So if you like my videos, please subscribe my channel, like it and subscribe it. So here I made some uh, uh, cable tray fittings. Okay, this is one fitting, so 600 mm cable tray. So this is 600 mm cable tray and I just made one uh, separate uh, rectangle for 600 mm uh, with the hatches and everything and this side also I created one uh, uh, hatches with a small rectangle with dimension with 600 so these three sides are uh, 600 so here is 600 and this one also 600 and this one also 600 so we'll see how it works okay so i just move it out down so i need first i need to create one block i call it as uh, this is cable tray ct 600 into 100 okay and i select the block and i pick the point okay i pick the pick here okay so this will be open in a block editor so it is showing like this so i need to set some parameters over here so i just go to the parameter first and i select linear like here and here i took one distance distance one i created and another one same thing linear i Okay, sorry uh, I just to create like uh, I need to stretch on on this way and I need to stretch on this way and stretch on this way so first I need to select the linear dimension uh, parameter so I select from here and I took distance one and again I took one so I selected from here to here distance two and I selected this way distance three so one one side I need to stretch to this way, one this way and one this way. So we'll see how it works. So next is the action we need. So I just uh, select action and uh, we use the stretch command and I selected this parameter. So it's selected and then I just drag, drag like this. Okay. And then select uh, this object and this object hatch and this one and enter it so it is developed here and same method I use this one and I select the distance and I use like this and select this and select this hatch enter it so this is also developed and another one uh, again stretch and select the parameter and uh, sorry select the parameter and uh, enter it select the parameter enter and stretch like this and select this and select this so it is created three sides by we set the parameters and uh, close the block editor save change okay so we'll see how it works or not so we select one part See it's uh, coming like this so wherever you need you can uh, stretch it up to the cable trays 600 mm cable tray no need to uh, draw it, draw it every time so it is worth see if even you can check this dimension 600 so we can check here 600 so here also 600 so from the fittings you can make the uh, dynamic block like this and even even the one cable trace here okay so you can rotate like this so we need to create one uh, this is uh, I call at uh, so 400 okay uh, this is 600 now just I stretch up to 100 again I place uh, 100 so this cable tray dimension is around 400 so I need to create one cable tray without uh, 
um, fittings so you just need to create first block uh, CT 400 into 100 okay and pick the point pick anywhere okay select block okay so it is uh, open to this uh, block editor so again then this uh, we need to add parameter uh, parameter into uh, linear parameter we have we will, we will use like uh, like this distance one so we need to stretch here and here so first we need to go action stretch select this select this point and drag like this and select this and select this enter it so one is created here okay and another one we need to create again stretch pick this point and uh, drag it like this and select this and select this and it. very simple so save this one so we can see here the cable tray it was stretching like this okay so it's very easy okay so hopefully you guys under same like this one also we can even reduce over here so you can make the same thing here also so i just copy and paste here so this is the part uh, small part i created uh, anyway without dimension only the dimension of the cable tray unit you can create one rectangle here and here also you can create this reducer is around 400 and here is coming 600 600 to 400 reducer so first we need to create uh, uh, one block producer uh, 600 to 400 I call it as like this and select the uh, pick the point okay select block okay so then what we'll do go to the parameter and we will just uh, linear dimension we will take it and select here and same thing we will do here also dimensions distance to and then the actions will took this one and this point and uh, drag like this and select uh, this one and uh, select this one enter it so it is uh, created here and the same thing stretch select this and pick this point and drag it like this and select this select this and the hatch selected okay save changes so we will see it works or not so 400 cable tray created and here is the 600 cable tray created so like that you can uh, you can make uh, dynamic blocks okay hopefully you guys are enjoyed this uh, video if you like this one please subscribe my channel support me thanks for watching thank you